Hello everyone, this is uh, Jerome Patrick and welcome to my YouTube video. Uh, today's video, I'm kind of going to summarize kind of what my journey has been this week in regards to uh, uh, working on my uh, company that I call the, the Patrick, um, excuse me, the Patrick Creative Company. Um, of recent, uh, I've, I've been working on a uh, online package protection service that we call uh, Custody. And we're working to try to bring it to the Hampton Roads area. Uh, we're kind of in a little bit of a snag right now because we're trying to figure out where the focus should be in regards to should we go after the customers first or should we look at getting our partners first. Um, it looks like from um, the research we, uh, done uh, via um, Harvard Business Review, I'm going to work on, uh, uh, excuse me, work on getting our partners uh, first before we reach out to uh, establish our customer base here in the uh, Hampton Roads area. Um, we are also uh, looking at, um, well, currently, currently I've been uh, working on some uh, understanding Facebook ads, learning a lot of great information from a lot of great people online um, in regards to how to effectively be, uh, excuse me, effectively use Facebook ads and how to make sure you're getting the, not only the best bang for your buck, but you're utilizing the Facebook ads in a way where you're able to um, remarket to clients uh, cheaper than always burning cash using Facebook ads by uh, putting plans in place where you're able to capture an email address or a phone number uh, through that customer's journey. If they, you know, they have a, a great interest, you know, sometimes you have to give them a freebie or a discount or things like that in regards to your website. Um, another thing I ran across was an individual by the name of Nick Cavito, or Cavuto. Uh, he's a branding specialist, worked with a lot of uh, top companies. I would advise to check him out if you guys are really interested in uh, brand development. Um, he's really, uh, he really believes right now, and he's been really been pushing the notion that uh, people now, being that a lot of industries are now getting saturated, or what I call them, Me Too's that are out there, it's going to be more imperative that an individual uh, establish his own personal uh, brand at this time with, you know, everybody working on possible businesses due to the COVID-19. People are really trying to work at alternate ways to establish revenue with that taking place. A lot of areas are kind of going to seem saturated no matter what business space you're in. So it's also it's going to be very imperative that you uh, start putting an investment on your personal brand. And uh, that has been my journey for the week here um, uh, for my, my startup journey. Uh, I want to thank you guys for your time. If you got any um, uh, tips or ideas on ways I can uh, do better, um, like I said, one of the things I'm currently working on right now, trying to work on doing a uh, landing page la uh, launch to um, to acquire partners for my, my startup company and also looking at um, you know effective ways where um, just to make sure that I'm running these landing pages effectively, please feel free to share your comments below. Thank you guys for your time and you guys have a great weekend.